quick video on uh, charging um, I'm charging the monster pro and as you can see the green light is on so one would assume it is fully charged and uh, more importantly balanced because we all know what happens with lithium cells when they are not in balance so most people as soon as that turns green they pull off the wheel and uh, i have found out with all the wheels the rs my ex and the monster pro once that green light comes on depending on how many packs your wheel has it actually carries on pulling currents uh, to balance and on the monster pro uh, it can be many hours um, I, I haven't really tested uh, or time to see how many hours after the green light it stops pulling currents um, but I, I I think I will for information purposes but uh, it was on green last night for about four hours I unplugged it and I've plugged it back in and it is green still but there is nothing else plugged into uh, my um, uh, AC side of the solar charger and as you can see it is pulling 36 watts so it is pulling about 0.3 um, amps and that keeps going to zero and then back up zero back up so it takes a while now if i unplug it from the monster pro let's see there i've unplugged it now it is not pulling anything now i'll plug it into my rs this has been fully charged and fully balanced the light is green and it is not pulling any watts now the rs um, stayed on uh, the charger for about an hour after the green light came on um, in that one hour again you know it would start pulling 35 watts back to zero 35 back to zero for about an hour and now it is not pulling any at all and if I plug it back into the pro I can do this with one hand it will carry on pulling uh, about 0.3 amps so the moral of the story is as soon as it turns green I wouldn't pull it off I would let it uh, stay on depending on which wheel you have if you've got one of these uh, watt meters you can plug that into the uh, uh, wall plug and then plug the charger into it and you can see when it stops pulling watts um, again like i said it does drop down to zero for a few seconds and then goes back up again to 35 watts um, depending on your wheel it can be one hour or it can be many hours in the case of the monster pro and uh, i nowadays i leave them on as long as the bms is uh, in good shape you're not going to get an overcharge because the bms decides when to pull uh, power 
to charge so i do leave it on even after the green light comes on uh, and i i look to see when it stops pulling uh, uh, any watts that is when i unplug the wheel because these lithium cells not being fully balanced can cause issue uh, over a period of time so that's my two cents worth say goodbye chichi